you let negativity just begin to dwell. And it can be, like I said, it can be toward an event. It can be toward an opportunity. It can be toward a job. It can be toward a person. It can be toward whatever. But whatever it is, once that downward spiral begins to go, you get depressed over that situation. And you know what? When you procrastinate, at least there's an opportunity of movement. But once you get depressed, and Satan knows this, once you get depressed, procrastination doesn't even work anymore. You stop. Dead in your tracks. Because Satan sets up an emotional roadblock. And so here's the reading scriptures here. Psalm 43 and 5 says, Why are you cast down on inner self? And why should you moan over me and be disquieted within me, hoping God and wait expectantly for him? For I shall yet praise him for who is the help of my sad countenance and my God. The message says, Why are you down in the dumps, dear soul? Why are you crying the blues? Fix your eyes on God. Change your focus. And soon you'll be praised again. He puts a smile on our face because he is God. Next time, y'all look at me and say, next time, run it through one time. I tell you, I was so sleepy last night. We went, I mean, it, was, it was a four or five hour drive getting back. And by the time I got back, oh, it was just, oh, it was just. So I'm sitting here and I'm working and I'm going. And I said, I got to make sure transition. They transition, all right. <laughs> all right. Proverbs 29, 18. Where there's no vision. The redemptive revelation of God, the people perish. But he who keeps the law of God, which includes that of man, blessed and happy, fortunate, uh, uh, enviable is he. Let me just let me just uh, 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 let God talk to us for a minute. How, how many? How many believe that God's give all of us a vision? Mm. How many believe that God wants to use us? How many believe that God's got everything under control? Amen. So the Bible says, where there is no vision, uh, the people perish. We have to trust God in the middle of it all. I like the message version. If people can't see what God is doing, they stumble all over themselves. But when they attend to what he reveals, they are more blessed. And then finally, let's go back to Isaiah 41 and 10. Isaiah 41 and 10. Somebody say God's awesome. Thank you. <laughs> Isaiah 41 10. Fear not, there is nothing to fear, for I am with you. Do not look around you in terror and be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen and harden you to difficulties. Yes, I will help you. Yes, I will hold you up and retain you with my victorious right hand of righteousness and justice. Now watch this. How do I take the saw out of my hand? I can focus right there in the scripture. That scripture right there has got everything I need to take the saw out of my hand. Let me show you. <laughs> 